One of the things that frustrates me the most about traveling is being confined to a single screen. If you couldn't tell from behind me, I love dual or even triple monitors, and I like to have a lot of screen real estate. But you just can't get that, even with a 15-inch MacBook Air or a 16-inch MacBook Pro. So a lot of companies have tried different methods of offering portable secondary displays. And those can be very useful, but today JSOC sponsored this video because they have a really unique take on this problem. And I know it looks like I just pulled out a second laptop because look at this thing, but these are actually folding, stackable, portable, dual monitors. Oh yeah, this is the Flip Go. It's an all-in-one portable workstation. And man, this thing sure is cool. It can use just a single USB-C cable to power two external displays. This thing is basically the foldable of the external display market. So how does this thing actually work and what can you do with it? Well, the key factor here is this thing has display link technology built in, which means that you can power both of these displays with a single USB-C cable and it will work on M1, M2, and M3 devices that only officially support a single display out. You've got a bunch of different stand options, the most portable of which is the folio here, which folds up very simply. You can just attach it magnetically and then the thing just sets up like so and you're good to go. Now, there's also this magnetic stand, which is great for keeping on a desk at work or at home, and you can actually vase mount this thing because there's a magnetic vase mount plate that can just screw right onto your existing arm, and then boom, you just pop it on and go. And these magnets are really strong, so this thing is not going anywhere. Just flip it open here and plug it in. Now this is the 13.5 inch Pro version. There is also a 16 inch version if you want even more screen real estate. But there we go, by default it's going to run as two displays. So we've got stacked dual monitors effectively. But you might be thinking, hey, what if I don't want two separate monitors? Well, fortunately, if we press this button here on the side, it switches into what they're calling ultra view. And that runs this as a single gigantic display. Yeah, that's a, that's a big boy. And that is really great for programming. I know a lot of programmers out there use vertical displays, but you might also now be wondering, well, what if I don't want a vertical display? What if I want a horizontal display? Eh? This time we'll use the magnetic stand and we'll just pop it on like so. Easy. Now we'll adjust the rotation and boom, there you go. Look at that. A big old horizontal display. You really do have a ton of freedom to do whatever you want with this display. That means you can use this in four different ways. Stacked vertical, stacked horizontal, or ultra view vertical and ultra view horizontal. That's a ton of flexibility and that's afforded by the two different USB-C ports. One is marked with the display link icon for using dual displays and the other is marked display port for the best experience in ultra view. But if you didn't think the utility could get any better than that, it actually can because this thing also has a built-in USB hub. You've got a USB-C which can be used for a keyboard and mouse and there's two USB-A ports as well. Now this thing has only just come out so there's still improvements ongoing, a lot more updates to come for this display in the future. But even just as it is, there's so many use cases that I can think of for this thing. Let me run you through a couple of them. So if I'm out and about on the go and I need to get some quick work done, this setup is perfect because it means I can bring my external Final Cut library and plug that into one of my ports and still be able to use the other port, even on a MacBook Air, to power two external displays. And that's absolutely perfect for the way that I edit in Final Cut Pro. I typically like to have everything in one window on my main display, and I like to use auxiliary displays for backup things. So the way I've got it set up here, I have Finder windows open so I can pull any clips that I might need. And up top, I've got Safari so I can pull anything off the web, check email, and that sort of thing. This is a great triple screen setup, but I know there are also other ways that you could rearrange this. For example, if you're willing to break out Final Cut Pro, you could totally put a viewer on your top display, and then you can have this totally awesome spread out Final Cut setup. But really the key aspect here is that this is all portable, that I can just 
bring this with me in a backpack. It's very light, very easy to transport, and on top of that, you're still getting all of this functionality. I mean, having two or three displays is usually something that is reserved only for my desk at home, and then I'm traveling and I'm just like stuck with a small single screen but not anymore. And because it's so portable, if I pack up and go home, I've got even more setup options when I get there. So now we can really kick things into high gear. With the folio cover removed, I've got the magnetic stand all ready and waiting, so we can go for a landscape orientation setup here, and why not bring in my iPad Pro for a fourth display? And this being iOS, just mouse to the right side of the screen and we've got continuity up and running. So now we have an M2 MacBook Air with dual displays and an iPad Pro. This is really the ultimate workstation and, and something that just wasn't possible a couple of years ago. It's honestly insane that technology is at this level now and even crazier than all of that is the fact that we are only using one single cable to run four displays. Now, I should also mention that the Flipgo ships with a USB-C power adapter, so if you plug it in, you can get higher max brightness, and you can also charge the MacBook that's connected to it. So if you wanted to have a more permanent setup with like a VESA mount and a USB-C charger, you could really get that nice and seamless. Wow, that is a lot of information, and really there's a lot that you can do with this thing. I was very impressed. I mean, when I, when I heard about this product, I was like, okay, all right, that sounds like an interesting idea. But now that I've actually had a chance to use it, boy, do I wish that I had had this earlier in the month when I went to Japan for two weeks, because this would have been really, really useful then. And I'm really curious to hear what you guys think. What would you do with a dual stacked portable monitor? Which display configuration seemed the most appealing to you? Would you use it landscape or vertical? Would you use ultra view or have two separate displays? There's just really so many possibilities. So a big thanks to JSOX for sponsoring this video. If you're interested in learning more and you would like to buy, it's just coming out right now. It's a very brand new product. So I'll have links for you guys down in the description below. And definitely leave a comment telling me what you think of this. Is this the ultimate Apple Silicon portable workstation? And of course, be sure to like and subscribe. And with that, I will see you guys in the next one.